Hey there Beatle fans, how you doing? It's Joe here and today I'm going to play something for some of the beginner guitar players out there who have asked me to play a nice simple Beatles song with only open chords and only a few chords to play and that song is Tell Me What You See. It's really quite a beautiful song actually if you listen to it. Lovely harmonies and uh, uh, everyone will enjoy playing it I'm sure. Uh, for the more intermediate players I'm going to add in that little piano lick in the middle of the song. The uh play that. So uh, let's begin. The song is basically just a G, C, and D song. Okay, nice open chords. And we're going to keep the uh, third finger over here uh, on the B string when we play the G chord just to make it sound nice and full. Second chord is a C chord but it's a little bit different. It's called a C add 9. So it's basically the same as this G we're going to keep these two fingers down over here, but we're just going to move these, uh, the first and second finger, to the next strings down. So, uh, like this, or the next strings up. So, from here to here. Okay. And then a D chord. And back to the G. And then C, and then the G. That's basically all you need for the uh, verses and the chorus, so let's take a look at it. Oh, nice open strumming, uh, just up and down, pretty simple, so don't worry too much, just uh, find a nice strumming pattern that works for you. Let's uh, continue on with the second verse, the second chorus. Big and black the clouds may be, time will pass away. If you put your trust in me, I'll be bright your day. Look into these eyes now, tell me what you see. is just a G7 chord, so the first finger on the first fret of the E string, and then the uh, second and third finger over here like a regular G. Tell me what you... And then a C chord. C. And then a G chord. And then we're going to play a D7 chord which is the first finger on the first fret of the B string, second finger on the second fret of the G string, and the third finger on the second fret of the E string. And then back to the G. Alright, so... Tell me So now, um, if you wanted to do that little piano look uh, after the Tell Me What You See, uh, this is what it's going to be like. Tell me what you see. Okay, uh, I'll show you how to play that. Now, if uh, just a little trick, if you're uh, using a pick and you want a finger pick at the same time, what I do is I uh, use the pick with my first and uh, my thumb and my first finger, and then when I want a finger pick, I kind of hide the pick uh, like this, 
and then I just uh, finger pick with my first and third finger. So, and now I just kind of hide it. Okay, well, uh, let's get into this uh, little piano lick. We're basically going to be plucking the second and fourth strings together and the first and third strings together. All right? And uh, we'll start off with the first finger on the first fret of B string and the second finger on the second fret of the D string. So this is the second and fourth strings. Now we're going to hit the first and third strings open. Now we're going to put our fingers on the first and second frets of the first and third uh, strings. And slide it up. And then open. And then down. Open. And then open again. Now we're going to play the second and fourth strings. We're going to put our uh, first finger on the third fret and our third finger on the fifth fret, like that, okay, and then open on the first and third string again, and then again the second and fourth strings with this uh, third and fifth pattern, and then pluck it again, and then go down to the uh, first and second fret on the second and fourth string, and then back up. kind of hard to really slow it down so let me play it a few times and I'll keep getting slower and slower all right but just remember the patterns that you need you need first and second fret first and second fret third and fourth fret first and second fret and also you need this on the second and fourth string here the third and the fifth all right so play this uh, D pattern chord and we're going to slide it up to the 7th fret. Okay, up here on the 7th fret it's actually a G chord. Same thing. All right, so once again, 2nd and 4th strings, then 1st and 3rd strings. string again, second and fourth string again, okay, and just one more time, back into the song. So that's it. Uh, you, he, I think George is playing this and he plays it uh, the first time and the second time a little bit differently so just listen to the uh, music and see just as a slight difference. Uh, when we get to the end, uh, the closing of the song, he, uh, he plays a shortened version of this. So when they, they don't do Tell Me What You See, they hum it. <laughs> So, hope you enjoyed the song, and uh, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to let me know. And uh, thanks for all the uh, kind words and support for everyone. So, until next time, we'll see you around. Peace out.